my name is Gianfranco Moreno from the EFWA team. Uh, today I'm going to show you uh, uh, how to consent the cookie. So uh, first I downloaded a couple of features from uh, the cam that are part of .NET Core. It's called uh, it's called context features and it automatically uh, creates the cookie consent and it saves it into the it saves it into the the browser so uh, in essence it's just a, a shared parcel view that has to be called on every single layout that we're going to be using I call it right before I call the index page right here And when I first load the application, it doesn't show because I have already accepted using cookies. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete that cookie to show the example. Sorry, it's not here. So you see ASP.NET consent, so this is the cookie that was created to consent the use of cookies. So I'm going to delete it and I'm going to refresh. So you see that now the, um, the page doesn't have the consent cookie authorization saved in the router. It's automatically uh, uploading the or showing the, the model. Even though I go into uh, any other page, it should still show until we accept. Usually the behavior of some pages is that uh, once you start navigating or scrolling, the consent of the cookies will disappear. But since we are going to be using cookies to pass the data, to save, uh, to pass the data between controllers, to save uh, login information, and to pass uh, temporary, temporal uh, or temporary uh, information or objects between view, model, and controller, we do need to force the user to uh, save cookies or accept the use of cookies. That's why uh, we can we have the link to learn more in our privacy policy where we're gonna provide uh, the uh, explicit information about how are we using cookies and once we click accept the the banner is not gonna show anymore and the cookie has been created again. So you see again that it was recreated because of that and it was just recreated right now. You see the time here and you see right now it's today time. So uh, it just it was just recreated again. If I replicate the behavior it will show again regardless of where am I in the application, where do I go? We will have to force the users to, to accept the use of cookies. Uh, that's it. Thank you.